الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد حبت في الله أهل التوحيد والسنة أهل السنة والجماعة they believe in the usul of iman and they believe and try and strive to practice what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says fi kitab al-kareem wa'atiyu Allah wa'atiyu rasul obey Allah and obey his messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam so ahl tawheed wa sunnah wa iman that for them their religion is priceless and their religion they believe is restricted they adhere to principles such as the asl of the asl fi ibadah al hadr for example that the origin of worship is that there is caution with regards to it or is that it is is muharram it's not permissible unless it is based on the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah وسلم, unless it's based on what the Prophet وسلم, came with from the book in the sunnah so they believe all any worship that contradicts that they restrict themselves and they consider that not to be ibadah but in fact to be shirk and likewise Ahl Tawheed wa Sunnah they also adhere to another qaida or principle which is that the asl of mu'amalat is ibaha al asl mu'amalat ibaha which means that the origin of uh, of other you know uh, practices and things that we do in transactions and our, our, our clothing and so forth is that it, everything is permissible Ex- unless there is something from the book in the sunnah and of course the ijma of the ulama to show that it's show that it's impermissible and their ijma of course has to be based on the kitab or sunnah so we can simplify that by saying unless there is something clear from the book in the sunnah the messenger of Allah وسلم, to show that it is muharram so the asl of when we look at clothing and we look at things is that it's, it's permissible permissible to wear it unless it goes against well-known principles in the Quran and the Sunnah or Nasus, direct text of the book and the Sunnah this is the menhaj or methodology of Ahli Iman wa Sunnah and we ask Allah the Almighty to bless us to be from them and forgive us of our many sins and shortcomings wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam